So I'm dear friends here by the Western Wall. And I want to talk to you about routine. Holiness has to be something that's routine. And a lot of people think, you know, someone from from birth, I'm basically from from birth, religious my whole life. And when we do things routinely, the prayer, the Torah study, it loses meaning. But that doesn't necessarily have to be the case. I think that's, that's not necessarily true for everyone. And it shouldn't have to be. So when you're consistent in your service of Hashem, in routines, being around holy people, coming to a holy place like the Western Wall, it becomes second nature that this is how you should act in the holy way and, and be, be in holy places. So the other day, I wasn't feeling good. My daughter was surprised. Someone was actually some, another child was surprised. One of my children, how are you able to go? You're you're you're, you're feeling sick. And so my daughter responded. The, the Kotel is like his house. It's like his bayit. It's 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 like it's home. So when you, you know when you're not feeling good, you want to go home. You want to be in the place that's that's regular for you. That's that's uh, that you're used to. That you're comfortable in. So the Western world to me has become like this. It's become a place of comfort, of something that even if I don't feel good, it's not difficult to push myself to because it's so routine. But it doesn't take anything away from being from being holy from the enjoyment and from getting the spirituality out of that that moment of, of being here so in fact we should have these routines we should have these consistencies of holiness of good things in our life being around good people on a regular basis holy rabbis people who are consistent in their Torah study and Yiddish guys and we too should have set times the Chazal teach us that having a set time to study is everything it's more important than than learning 10 hours or 8 hours a day would be to have a, a time for that learning even even if it's shorter even if you make 15 minutes a day for his bodhis or 20 minutes you start out 20 minutes of Torah study at 2 in the afternoon and then you know another 10 minutes even at night that consistency of making those manim and those special times is what gives us strength and, and gives us a foundation for our Yiddishkeit for what's going to follow and then even if we don't feel good it couldn't be it's not possible for us to miss that 20 or 10 minutes which hopefully will grow it's impossible because it's just a part of us so we have to make our level of holiness much much higher our standard we have to build up our standard that we're consistent and that there's holiness in everything we do on a regular basis. Shalom, we're going to go inside to pray. Thank you for joining me.